Kindle Ozzel served as an admiral for the Galactic Empire following the destruction of the first Death Star. Ozzel was often commanding Lord Vader's executor where he is found at the beginning of Episode 5 before famously being forced choked to death after failing Lord Vader one too many times. In Awakening the Rebellion, Admiral Ozzel is a playable hero for the Empire right at the start of campaigns. On the Galaxy map, Ozzel does not provide any special features and is only used during battles. Admiral Ozzel is considered a major hero, therefore he is rescuable if he dies in combat. With that being said, in order to follow the events of Episode 5, when the player reaches Hoth, Ozzel will be permanently killed and replaced with Admiral P.S. In Space Battles, Admiral Ozzel commands from the Imperial Star Destroyer 1, Rapture. Ozzel holds the rank of Bad Admiral, which provides a unique, minus 10% combat bonus for all ships. Regardless of the negative combat bonus, Ozzel does provide two really important things. First is his Star Destroyer, which you can't really go wrong with that. Additionally, he provides a Star Destroyer right at the start of campaigns, giving you a great frontline tank and damage dealer. Ozzel's Star Destroyer is unmodified, and therefore for the most part he should be used just like any other Star Destroyer. After discussing Ozzel's Bad Admiral rank with the community, it seems like most people do not find him to be a hero worth using, even with the Star Destroyer, because the negative 10% combat bonus applies to minus 10% health, shields, armor, fire rate, and damage for all ships in your fleet. Therefore, on the Grand Layout map where he spawns in a location away from the core, many players tend not to use him because of his rank. However, on the Standard Layout map, Ozzel spawns in the same region as Darth Vader. If both of these heroes are in the same battle, then the combat bonuses each hero provides zero out. At that point, you have a neutral combat bonus and two Star Destroyers in one battle right at the start of campaigns. Ultimately, how you use Ozzel is up to you. As I said, he provides a weak one Star Destroyer which can have a huge impact early on, however, his negative 10% combat bonus does make a pretty big difference. Personally, I think the ISD is worth it, especially if you can bring in another hero to counteract his bonus. Drop a comment and let me know if you believe Ozzel is worth using, or if his bad admiral rank is not worth it. In ground battles, Admiral Ozzel cannot be used. Final rating, 5 out of 10 hero.